we got the Optic 4 XL Next Gen. Uh, just wanted to give you guys a quick look on how the Optic LEDs come. Um, you know, discreet brown box, uh, double box for the larger lights. And uh, yeah, they got the extra bit of strapping on them too, uh, which is nice. So yeah, let's uh, get into this bad boy. And uh, we got two of these to open up. And then these will be going into a four by eight grow tent. And we'll be running some, uh, some of the OG KZ from Humboldt Seeds in there. So yeah, let's get to uh, unboxing this bad boy. All right, so after opening her up, double boxed here, you can see. Got the uh, nice thick foam surrounding it. Uh, you got your power cord and your ratchet ropes in that little box there. And then, yeah, that's what we got there. The same bloom enhancer array as the uh, Optic 8 Plus next gen, as well as the new um, far red bloom enhancer array. Uh, is set up like this as well, and both all are compatible with the master controller. So yeah, let's get this thing out of here and give you guys a few close-up shots, and then we'll get them uh, hung up in the tent. And here we have them both side by side. Looking good. So we'll zoom in here. You guys can see the solderless cob holders there. And then under the smaller LEDs there, you can see the four Samsung 301H. And you got the Cree XPE reds and blues in there, like the Slim series, like the uh, Gen 4 series, uh, like the Optic 8, everything's using uh, the uh, Cree XPEs now. So yeah, we got uh, we got these guys unboxed and ready to go. So let's get them all set up. Sweet, stoked for this guy, stoked. And we have them hung up. Looking good. So what we're doing in this tent, like I said, is the OG KZ. We're going to be doing three plants only. And what do you guys think? Should we go with the 12 gallon grow pots or uh, grow bags or the 25 gallon pot? Um, and keep in mind, we're only doing three plants. So, um, you know, kind of want to go for the most I can get out of it. Uh, I know I'm not going to, you know, hit max yield or anything like that doing, you know, a plant and a half of light essentially. Um, but we want to keep this grow real nice and simple. We're growing FEMS, and yeah, we're going to just do three plants in here in the Stepwell Super Soil. So yeah, let me know uh, in the comments below what you guys think. I kind of leaning towards the pot, even though grow bags, you know, generally will put more oxygen to your roots, but the size difference, you know, that's twice the size. Um, and I have the soil, um, so it doesn't matter either way. Um, but yeah, that's what we got going on, guys. But let's take a look at these lights. Got the 4XL Next Gen. Boom. We got our master controller there that we're gonna get set up. Couple new fans at either end, right in front of the vents. We got the can filter there. AC Infinity fan, and that uh, exhaust will be coming out and then exiting um, straight out of the room, actually, through the wall into the next room, so the wall, the air will circulate really well in here. But yeah, the pair of 4XL Next Gen. You got the Cree XPE uh, reds and blues, Samsung 301H for the white. Uh, the cobs are obviously the Cree CXB 3590s, 3500 Kelvin in this light here. Meanwhile drivers, dimmable. You got your bloom, bloom in your cobs. 
love these lights, guys. Optic LED, a casing, beautiful housing lights. Some of the nicest lights on the market, in my opinion. But yeah, guys, that's what we got going on. So we're just waiting for some seeds to come in the mail. And then we will uh, we'll get her going. So we'll come back with another video talking about uh, what we're going to be using for soil and amendments um, and all that kind of stuff. And then after that, we should be, uh, seeds should be here in the mail. We should be ready to go. So, yeah, hope you guys are doing well. Have a great weekend. And we'll talk to you later. Cheers.